Hey guys, welcome to the BD Themes widget tutorial. Today we'll show you how to use the crossroad slider presented by the Prime Slider plugin. Let's drag and drop the slider on the page editor. After inserting the widget, you'll see a demo slider with lots of animations and hover effects. Clicking on a slider item reveals the content with a cool entrance animation that you'd love to see more. This dynamic slider interacts with mouse clicks and hovers. On the left side under the content tab, you can see the slider item section containing the item list. You can add or remove items in this section. When you click on an item, you will see the fields for the slider name, meta and image. Let's change the title and then the image. After that, go to the model subsection. Here you can change the title, optional meta text, button text, button link, and text. Just follow the same process for the second and third and the rest of the items. Just do as shown here, it'll take some time. After finishing the job, take a good look at the slider now. Next, go to the slider settings section. Here you can change the slider height using the first scroll bar. Then comes the item gap scroll bar and text alignment for the counter above the image. There are some switchers below to show or hide specific elements like title, meta text, excerpt, button, and number. Just for a test, let's disable the show excerpt and show button switchers then see what happens by clicking on an item. See, the selected areas are not showing that where on the right side of the image. Now it's time to decorate the slider. Go to the style tab. Here you can adjust the tilt of the slider using the rotate scroll bar. Just play a bit to see what happens. Below, there are four subsections containing controls for title, meta, number, and image. Let's go to the title subsection and change the text color. You can also change the typography, set a text shadow, and give a text stroke. Let's rotate the text a bit to fit the screen. Now go to the meta subsection. Here you can change the color and line color, set the margin on top, bottom right and left and you can change the typography of it in the number subsection you can change the stroke color along with stroke width using the scroll bar in the image subsection you can add border border radius and customize css filters you can also change the image size from the drop down list now go to the model section here you can change the background type header padding and content padding. Below it, there are three subsections for title, meta and image customization. Let's change the text color first. The same color goes to the meta too. You can change the height of the image, use CSS filters and the image size option. Let's test the height and see what happens. Great! Now go to the cursor section, here you can switch between dark and white cursor images. That's it for the crossroad slider, thanks for watching, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel and stay updated, until next time.